Hi guys, I know, I know it's been ages. Just don't ask, <laughs> don't ask. Okay, well I'll tell you, I'll tell you why I've been missing. I've been having a very passionate love affair. Yeah, I've been having a very passionate summer love affair. And what can I say? Okay, I've been having a very passionate love affair with my garden, I know, with my garden. <laughs> no, seriously guys, my garden, the weeds, it was growing sky high, it was looking an absolute disgusting mess, I'm so embarrassed, and I just got this a massive, massive motivation to clean it out, you know, just get rid of all the crap and just dig up and, you know, landscape and just, bring some freshness to my garden. It's always been a dream of mine and I have really been dedicated to it and it's cost a lot of money and a lot of time and I've not had any help or support doing it. And I'm just so proud of it. It's like a, it's like Kew Gardens now. It's like you've got every kind of flower that you can imagine growing and they've got roses and vines and it's just so beautiful. And it's just something I've wanted to do for years and I finally started. So. Yeah, that's where I've kind of been, a amongst other things, obviously, you know, life, life just takes over. So, yeah, just being busy with being a mum. My daughter's started high school now for the first time, and it's just reorganising the home and just putting some feng shui into my life, my wardrobe, my bedroom, my living room, and it's been really overwhelming but it's been extremely, extremely rewarding. So I'm so sorry for just not being around. I have so much to show you. Now, let me just, let me just get to the nitty gritty of what this video is about. This is not a joke. <laughs> this is an epic random haul. That, I mean, that's all I can call it. My birthday was in August. I was going to do this amazing birthday perfume video. I just didn't get the time. And I have just been purchasing things online. I've received gifts and I haven't opened them. I've had so much willpower and I've been so busy that I've just kind of got this massive stockpile. And I'm not joking. I've got this massive stockpile here and here in front of me. And it's just full of goodies. So if you're interested in watching a haul that contains perfumes obviously fragrances i have uh, home accessories i've got accessories um clothes lingerie candles just stick with me and let's just get through this because this is like a month and a half's worth of shopping <laughs> quite frank that's what it is it's a month and a half's worth of shopping and I just haven't opened it. Some are blind buys, some I have opened the packaging just to see because I've been so excited, but everything is brand new and oh, I'm so excited to do this. My my daughter's been coming into my bedroom saying, mum, when are you going to do your video? Because it's getting crazy. And I'm like, I know, I know. So let's just get started. First of all, to get started, you know me, I like a little drinky so get your nibbles because this is going to be a very long video and sorry I've got my nose is tickling me sorry so I've got this my cocktail strawberry dakiri and it's been in the freezer it's got strawberry and lime juice from concentrate mixed with alcohol it's a four percent so it's quite light and I have from Marks and Spencer's really tasty naughty maple bacon hand cooked crisps mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. <laughs> so the first out of the haul i am i promise you i am going to get into the uh the, the fragrances first where if i see them i'm going to grab them but they might be scattered throughout the video so the first out of the haul i got myself some new cocktail glasses and what seems to be in trend at the moment is this kind of iridescent unicorn uh, colored 
theme that's going on and I love it I love the kind of like translucent opal it's pretty really really pretty so I'm going to take a glass out of here to enjoy my cocktail I got issues you got them too <laughs> I hope you've all been well I hope you've had a great summer I'm so so looking forward to autumn Oops. very fragile whoops okay let's get this party started guys if you see the chaos that is in front of me packages and packages and packages and packages I've been very spoiled this year I only get presents like on my birthday. I don't like getting presents at Christmas time. I don't mind a present at Valentine's and um, you know, Mother's Day. But birthdays, I kind of go big. Why not, you know? Why not? If you can spoil yourself, spoil yourself. What have I done? I think I've opened it wrong. Bear with me. So cheers, cheers to the end of summer. Cheers to seeing you guys again, connecting with you guys again. It smells so good. Ooh, it's a really beautiful sunny day in London. And I'm just feeling good guys, I really am. I've had a bit of a tricky year, but you know, say la vie. Cheers, clink, 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 cheers. Mm. that is so good oh yes if you haven't got a snack please get yourself a snack because I'm a chatterbox I'm a chatterbox and we've got a lot to get through. Mm. Okay guys, are you ready for this epic random haul? I'm going to start with some gifts that I got for my birthday. Some beautiful body mists. A really good friend of mine treated me to some new Victoria's Secrets fragrance mists. She got them from Philadelphia. She went to visit her daddy. And I just think the packaging is absolutely gorgeous. I love it. Look at that. So this one is Exotic Bloom, and this one is a Lush Palm. Very similar, but you can see the difference, right? This has got kind of like a gold foil, rose gold foil, and this is more of like a pink foil. And it just smells so bloody good. Lush Palm is more, oh, so beautiful. It's more like a strawberry kind of scent. I don't like strawberry scents, so it doesn't smell exactly strawberry. I'm not sure what the notes are, but it's just so, oh, it's quite long lasting. It's been really good to wear in the summer, but I just kind of want to reserve it for next summer or spring. But it's so sweet and sexy. I love this. It's a really good everyday body mist, really nice for bedtime or romantic liaisons. And this is Exotic Bloom. It's 
that one. Oh, it's lovely. This is more of a floral suite. Oh, I love it. I don't know which one I prefer, but you know, lay them together, you can't go wrong. So, birthday fragrances from a good friend of mine, and another good friend of mine went to Canada. That's what I mean. I've been spoilt this year. I don't know what's going on. I'm loving it. So, a really good friend of mine uh, went to Canada and she went to Bath and Body Works and she bought me this back. This is one of the best body mists I've ever had. I love, look at that. Look at that. It's like a rich, in, oh, it's a rich, beautiful, glossy shimmer inside. And the scent is amazing. I love the packaging. So pretty and girly. And look at this. I don't know if it will show up on the screen, but when I mean it is glitter. If you don't like glitter, do you know what? I think I'm losing weight, you know. I'm losing weight in the wrong places because this ring doesn't fit me anymore. So I better take that off, keep sliding off. But I'm putting on weight in the wrong places. Yeah, so. Yeah, so this is uh, Diamond Sweet. This is by Bath and Body Works. It's the Sweet Pea Diamond Shimmer Mist. What does it say? It doesn't really have the, no, it doesn't have the notes, but it says it's dazzled with diamonds. It's infused with real diamond dust. It's really? Our luxurious diamond shimmer mist kisses skin with irresistible fragrance and gorgeous sparkle and it does do you know this is a very long lasting mist and it's got the most amazing shimmer i don't think it will show up on the camera but it, it really does glisten and sparkle and dazzle really good for a night out or really good for your holidays i love this it's amazing and we don't have bath and body works in the uk so i really treasure this okay I'm just warming up. I haven't filmed for a while, so bear with me, guys. Sorry. Okay. Wow. This is seriously crazy. Right, what do I do next? <laughs> I'm just overwhelmed. I'm overwhelmed with the amount of things I've got here. Okay, so perfumes, perfumes, perfumes. Okay, this one's sitting right in front of me, so I'm just going to open it, okay? This is exquisite. <sighs> Sexy Blossom by Michael Kors. I love the packaging. Pink and gold. Pink and gold to me is just the most gorgeous combination of colours. Look at this. Look at this, guys. Oh, wow. It's so, 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 so pretty. I've opened it before, so the cap I put on the wrong way. The scent is amazing. Right. This is really important, take note. I am starting a new series, and it's called, sorry, got hair on my lip. Oops, sorry. I'm starting a new series, and it's called My Two Cents. One. That's so annoying. Right, repeat again. Okay, so I'm starting a new series, and it's gonna be called My Two Cents. Like, you know, my two cents, like my opinion of something, but scents as in fragrance, ha ha ha. And I'm going to just give you more detail about two fragrances that are really good combinations together or in the same family of notes and, and scents that are in the same family of fragrance. And I'm just gonna just give you my review of it, break down a little bit of history about it and so on. So I'm not gonna give you full detail now in this haul because it will take hours. I mean, I've got 12 perfumes to show you, 12 perfumes 12 perfumes yeah but I'm telling you it's a 
huge blast very very strong lychee fruit sweet it's tropical and it's so delicious i love it this perfume was a blind buy and it's one of the best blind buys i've ever made if you really like your sweet tropical scents you're going to absolutely love this perfume i mean look at the design as well it's just so glam beautiful right it's just so glamorous i love it all right moving on because time is ticking time is really ticking okay so michael calls we've done okay random haul so i got these earrings from henny's henny's is h&m but i grew up calling it henny's henny's and Maurits. that's what h&m stands for but these are really cute i have some ideas for this and just to match the earrings i got whoops I got a choker. I'm really into chokers, guys. I love that the 90s have come back. Chokers are my thing. So I think, you know, smooches. So I'll show you in another video. I'll put this as a combination piece. Okay, I have a jumbo turbo flame lighter. What for? For the candles? So the candles. <laughs> I got recommended this by a YouTuber that I watch and this is Yankee Candle, Sea Salt and Sage. <clears throat> Excuse me. It smells bloody hell. It smells amazing. It actually makes my mouth water. It's a sweet, salty, yummy. I just smell like I'm on the veranda of, I don't know if I'm in the south of France and I'm on the veranda. I'm looking out at the ocean front or the sea or the... I just love it. I just see waves. I see peace. I see serenity. It just smells divine. The cold scent is really strong. So I'm imagining that when this burns, it's going to be fantastic. Another candle. I've bought more candles, but I've burnt them. They're kind of halfway down now, three quarters down. So there's no point showing you. I'll show them in a video in another way. I've already started to burn this. This again is really arousing. I'm not going to lie to you. It's just arousing. It makes, it just is such a mood lifter. It makes me feel so good. I love this. This is black cherry. I've had my eyes, my eyes on this for a while. I totally recommend this, especially for the fall, autumn season. This is lovely in your bedroom, in your hallway entrance, lovely in your living room. It's so, it's just gorgeous then i went to tk maxx and i purchased this candle i love the jar isn't the jar just so amazing love the jar it's massive so heavy it's made in poland it just smells like a creamy vanilla and this is for my bedroom i just really like the um votive but it wasn't expensive either. And there's another candle which will pop up somewhere. Okay, other things in front of me. <laughs> I've got to remember what I've shown you. Um, these are chokers. I, I have an account with ASOS. And they give me so many vouchers. So I stack them up. And then you have to use them. They have an expiry date on them. So you have to use them. So it's just, it's like a voucher to spend on stuff. And I just, I'm really into chokers. So I just bought a load of chokers and literally paid nothing for them. You know, I'm really into voucher codes. I'm really into uh, like memberships that give you something back. If you are going to be a member of a beauty club or, you know, an online retailer shopping you know that sell perfumes or clothing you've got to get something back from it not just junk mail in your email they've got to offer you a you know, it's, they've got to have a reward scheme so <laughs> sounds so manic <laughs> they've got to offer you some kind of reward scheme that make you shop more or just thank you for being a customer you know so i'm gonna show you the chokers this is so pretty oh wow Oops. Well, they packaged it really well. Too well. Oh my God, look. I can't. 
don't know if it's their fault or my fault, me getting carried away. So this is a metallic pink choker. You know what, you can make these yourself. But I mean, I was getting these for free, so, you know. Oh, I love that. I could just wear that now. They've got a massive sale at the moment, by the way. I think it's too tight. <laughs> I think I put it on too tight. Okay. Yeah, and another choker. I'm actually going to do a choker collection video because I've got quite a few and it would be nice to dress up and show you what they look like. This is uh, from ASOS as well and the brand is Love Rocks. I think it's so pretty. So, so pretty. This was like £30 and then it went down to something like £3 or something. But again, I didn't pay for them because I had the vouchers to use. How lovely is that? I think I've put this on too tight. <laughs> you just adjust it. That's better. Okay. Right, so those are some chokers. I've got more chokers to show you. I don't know where they are. We'll find them. They'll turn up. Blind by time. Perfume blind buys. Lord, give me the strength and perseverance, please. Okay. The first one is, I just don't know, I don't remember. I can visualise it, but I can't remember the brand name. <laughs> so exciting. I have always wanted to try these perfumes. I think it's gonna be amazing, right? This is by Balmain, Balm Balmain. And this is Ecstatic, Ecstatic, Ecstatic. <laughs> and this is Gold Mask Eau de Toilette and it's a 60 ml. I just can't wait, I can't wait to show you guys. <laughs> And this is its brother or sister. But it's such a mess. It's a mess upon mess upon mess. And this is another Balmain. And this is Ecstatic Tiger Orchid. So Tiger Orchid and Gold Musk. And this is a 90 mil. I just can't wait to open them. Oh my god guys you see how loyal I am to you guys I haven't opened these perfumes I've been waiting for this moment that is some serious willpower I've never ever held back like this before sounds like a song I've never held back like this before okay for those of you just joining me for the first time Yes, I cut the cellophane off because I like to kind of protect the um, packaging and I open my perfumes from the bottom. It's just something I do. Might as well do that one at the same time. Hope you have all had a lovely summer and everybody is well and happy. I uh, know that um, some of you follow me on Instagram. I love Instagram. If you want to know if I'm alive and well and kicking, come on to my Instagram. It's Missouri Love, and you'll see that I'm all right. <laughs> okay. So should I open this one first? This is Ecstatic Balmain Tiger Orchid. Oh. Here we go. Oh. It's really heavy. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. Guys. Oh, my God, it looks amazing already. I've just seen the lid. 
What am I doing? Ooh! Oh my goodness! Oh wow! What a lovely, lovely weight. Please, Lord, let me like this blind buy. Are you ready? Better put it on the other wrist. Oh, God, it's lovely. Oh, my goodness. Guys. Oh, wow. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Oh wow, it's um it's amazing. This is um okay, my head's spinning. I got a good blind buy. I got a good blind buy. This reminds me instantly of like some type of Tom Ford, like a velvet orchid sweet. I'm not into patchoulis, it's not patchouli, it's like a sweet, it's a very oh god, it's gorgeous. It's very Tom Fordy. It's on the velvet, it's in the velvet orchid family, but it's sweet and sexy and underrated. Wow. I just wanted to give um, a new perfume that I've not heard of a try and I just love the packaging. I love all kind of like animal print designs and it just, it's, it's so expensive looking and it smells expensive, it smells so expensive and sophisticated oh my goodness it's lovely this is a winner so let me put that here wow i am impressed that is definitely going to be long lasting wow i wonder what i need to investigate that more so i'm in my new series i will definitely give these to a you know their own platform and I'll do all the research to find out what notes are in them and you know the history behind it give you more explanation but that is an amazing perfume wow I don't see it anywhere I just saw it online and I thought you know what let me just go for it it wasn't that expensive it was definitely like 20 something pounds 25 pounds maybe gosh guys so again, my brain's gone. What's it called? Gold musk. Gold musk. How beautiful. The weight. I, I'm really respecting the weight of these perfumes. I don't know what kind of thumbnail I'm going to do for this video, but is that a good one? Oh, please. I've been an awfully good girl. Please, can I like this one too? The lid. Look at the lid. It's so gorgeous. Okay, there's nothing on my wrist. The spray is really good as well. Okay, it's a bit of a strong alcohol push, but... It was strong alcohol and and beauty at the same time. Oh wow. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna let the alcohol just subside for a bit, but it's so pretty. Wow. This is fresher. This has definitely got more aromatic kind of um notes. Oh, it's so sexy. This now. Oh, it's lovely. Oh, my goodness. This is like, um, I don't know. It just smells. It's fresher. It's got more of a, it smells almost, if you like Emozioni by Salvatore from Ferragamo. <laughs> if you like Emozioni by Salvatore Ferragamo, if you like Chanel number no. five, this is more the Chanel number no. five. This is the family of Chanel number no. five. It's that kind of uh, sensual, feminine, slight powdery. I don't know what the notes are. I'm so sorry, guys. I really don't know the notes, but I will set up another video exclusively for these. Oh, my goodness. If you get your hands on these, you will be so impressed. Oh, my God. I'm 
I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Wow. So that's three blind buys so far. The Michael Kors Sexy Blossom and the Balmain perfumes are absolutely fantastic. Right. I knew that was going to happen. Okay, look at the packaging of this. This is from Pretty Little Thing. I was watching in the UK, in the United Kingdom, we've got this TV show that comes on every day called Come Dine With Me. It's one of my favourite shows. And it's a show where contestants go to each other's houses. They've never met each other before. And it's a cooking... <clears throat> and it's a cooking competition. So they have to vote on who is the best um, host and best cook. And at the end of the week, they all win a thousand pounds. And there was a stunning blonde girl that was on the show maybe a couple of weeks ago. And she wore this top. And I didn't realize it's actually in trend at the moment. And it's a embroidered sheer top with floral patterns. And now after that show, I'm seeing it everywhere. I love it. So I bought it. I've tried it on already, it's a dress. It's not a top, it's a dress. It's so lovely, guys. Look at the unicorns. Oh, wow. I just love it. Do you know what I love about it? It zips at the back. See the zip at the back? It's so pretty. I just love it. It's just crazy. I'm just so into my flowers at the minute. So yeah, this is from Pretty Little Thing. They keep this tag on. So if you don't want it, you know, you just keep the tag on and send it back. But I just, flower power, guys, flower power. Can you, and I bought this lovely bra that will go with this, but it's somewhere in the pile. I'll show it to you soon. Amazing. And okay, it's another clothing item. Uh, uh, we're having an avalanche. Avalanche of. <laughs> this is from Primani, Primark. I think Primark's only available in the UK. And I just wanted a lovely cashmere kind of sweater for the colder season and this is like a baby powder blue and it's extra large and it's just so lovely it's so soft and beautiful it's only a tenner and they've got different colors they've got this beautiful bright kind of like orange like this kind of color um and it's just oh, it's lovely excuse me <clears throat> hope i haven't missed anything oh what's this it's that christmas is that I feel like <laughs> you don't you don't want to see you don't want to see what what's going on here. It's a madness. It's a, it's it's a pretty mess. Let me just say that it's a pretty mess. Uh huh. Okay, this was absolute bargain. It's one of my favourite perfumes. You won't believe it. I can't remember where I got it from. Oh no. I think I got it from Essential, but I paid like twenty pounds because I had points and it was just on it was just on discount. I keep telling everyone, please check the 50 mil and the 100 mil. Automatically you will think that when you're buying from perfume retailers online, you'll think that the 100 mil will be more expensive. It's not always the case. It's kind of a trick. The 30 mil and the 50 mil are normally more expensive than the 100 mil, the 100 mil. Not always, but just give it a try, especially when it's sell time. 20 I think I paid about 20 pounds for this you're not gonna believe it so and they've given me some goodies Britney Spears fantasy in bloom I do have a drawer full of fragrance perfume samples and I'll go through it with you someday so I'm gonna put that in my sample drawer and another one is fresh machino never smelt this before 
I'm presuming it's going to smell. Machino Pink Fresh Couture. I'm, just, I'm assuming it's going to smell really clean. Put it there. Oh, it's lovely. Hold on, I'm confused now. Do you know what? I'm confused. I don't know. Is that the Michael Kors or is it this? Oh, God. It, I think it's this. I think it smells like the Michael Kors. It's amazing. It's very, it smells like the colour pink, what the colour pink would smell like. It's sweet, it's girly, it's fresh, it's pretty, it's clean. Da -da, da -dee, da -dee. So, sample drawers. Now, the bargain of the summer, one of the bargains of the summer, a 100ml Ralph Lauren Romance. I love this scent. I'm not going to open it because I've already got one that I need to finish, but I will open it soon because my other one is down to its last drops but i'm going to present this into a nice video that i've got planned i have some ideas coming darlings so that's rather and i don't have any space oh my god this i don't know <laughs> there's so much to show you it's ridiculous okay Ah, oh. guys, if you don't know about this, I am going to teach you. Oh, it's not that one. Sorry. Okay, I went to Selfridges and I treated myself. Now, listen, I don't really wear lip gloss. I'm more of a matte lip girl, as you can see. But I don't really like to wear lip gloss. I don't really like the gloopy kind of feeling on my lips. And... I don't know if it's living in the city, the grit that can bounce onto your lips or the green flies in the summer. I just don't like it. However, I don't mind gloss or a sheen that's kind of not gloopy and like rich syrupy kind of thing. So I went to Selfridges and I treated myself to a Dior Addict Milky Tint. And the packaging is amazing i love it i absolutely love it. this is um pink no milky tint milky pastel can't get it out <laughs> try the other side i'm so used to opening things upside down ah oh, no wonder look at this look at the packaging for this i mean it's just gorgeous it's just gorgeous dior I love it. And this is a gloss. And it's got this kind of vacuum suction to it. When you open it. It's so mild. It's literally like you're putting water on your lips. It's not... It's thin, but it it's... Uh, it's just so moisturising and light, and that's what I like when it comes to lip glosses. I don't like the fuss of a, I don't like heavy gloop. Like the MAC um, lip gloss is not for me. I have it, but I don't really use, I don't use it. It's so light and pretty. But the packaging's amazing. And let me tell you something, when this finishes, I will be squeezing my own lip gloss into this. Or I might just get another colour. But you can reuse it. It's so pretty. Put that back in. Loads to get through. Okay. Oh, this is... I need this now, actually. My friend who bought me the um, sweet pea, Teresa, I went into her bag as I do because her bag is so pretty and it's so organized and she's always got everything that I need and I went in there to get some hand cream and this just smelled amazing this is Garnier ultimate blends hydrating cream marvelous oils argan and camellia oils I've never heard of that before I've never heard of camellia oils and it's non-greasy non-sticky and no parabens and it's normal to dry hands and I love the packaging. I've never seen, I didn't realise that Garnier did hand cream. I thought they just focused on hair products, but 
it's so lovely in the scent the aroma is hmm <laughs> doesn't smell like how it, how it smelled on her the other day I think I've got a mixture of everything I don't know it's very nutty it smells nutty I wonder if I've got the right one anyway I need it so let me just rub that in okay so we've got the hand cream next we have a uh, a uh, a break cuz i can't believe i i can't believe <sighs> let's go I'm going to cover the barcode just in case there is no address on here. I This was delivered to me with no address on it. How cool is that? Just my name. Perfume. So Mary Claire have a company called Fabled. And I would thoroughly, thoroughly, thoroughly recommend it because they do free next day delivery and you can choose your hour slot and they don't put your address on the packaging and it's packaged lovely and I've ordered from them before and they always give you a Mary Claire magazine inside for free. And you always get some kind of discount code. I got 15% off this perfume. This perfume is a dream. I don't know if I'm going to open it now. I'm just going to show you what it is. I'll have a special video to show you a bit more. Look at this. This is a Bulgari. <laughs> this is Bulgari Rose Goldea, the essence of the jeweler, eau de parfum, and it's a 50 mil. I really wanted to get the bigger size, but I just couldn't afford it. It was too, it was too expensive. Um, I just couldn't do it. It's like it was going into like a hundred and something pounds or 80 pounds or 70 pounds. It's too expensive. I got this for under 50 pounds with Fabled. But you have to use voucher codes. Don't be frightened to search for them. And use them. So I think I'm going to open this in a special video. Or should I just open it and just and talk to you about it in another video I just don't know what to do I don't know what to do you've waited this long for me oh and I've got to open it I don't even know if it's broken or you know do you know what I'm going to open it from the top should I should I I just don't know what to do I'm so excited the packaging looks, oh my god, the packaging looks so amazing, guys. It looks so... Oh, oh wow, it's like silk. You can't, can you see? Look. It's like silk. Let me cut from the top this time. Make a change. Have you missed my crazy ways? Oh dear, dear, dear. There's so much more. There's so many more perfumes and goodies to share with you. Oops, don't want to damage it. I just don't want to damage the box. Right. Oh my god guys <laughs> so beautiful how beautiful is this perfume now the larger one, if you can get your hands on the larger one, it's so worth it. It's so grandeur and opulent.
but I mean the 50 mil is just as beautiful it really is I'm not gonna spray it spray it Just admire it, guys, like this. Speechless. I, I'm not going to talk about that perfume right now, except to say it's the bomb. It's just uh, if you don't like rose perfumes, you will not like this. It's a very, it's like the goddess of rose. It is a very, mi not mild, not the right word. It's a goddess-like rose perfume. It's so, it's so angel-like. Oh. I can't. <laughs> this is a mug from Primark and one of my subscribers, she's so lovely, Anna, her name's Anna, she uh, was the one, she loves Disney, she's a Disney junkie, and uh, she's on Instagram, she's got a really cool Instagram account where she shows all her Disney collectibles, and she told me about this little mug, and it was like impossible to find, and now all of a sudden it's available in a lot of the local Primark stores in London, and I just think this is so sweet, isn't it? So I'm going to have a little cup of coffee in there one day. I'll bring this little mug out in one of my videos. I've got a few mugs here, actually, or maybe another one. I don't know. But I do love mugs. And I like them that size as well because I don't like to have big, like, mugs of coffee. I like to have, like, half a cup. Okay, what do we have here? Some bits from TK Maxx to get me organised. I love jotters and notebooks. And there's another online friend of mine called Hort, per per Hort Perfumista. And she has got a very organised, dedicated Instagram account. Um, and it just shows her all her, shows you her organising notebooks and diaries. And she's very inspiring to me. And I think it's getting into fashion now. So this is going to be another notebook I might use for just design ideas that I have around the house. And also for my perfumes. And like just take notes of the things that I enjoy and put my wish list on here for things that I want in life and my goal list but another extraordinary uh, book is this one this is a 2018 I like it on time weekly planner and it starts from August and it ends in December 2018 which I like and it's just so beautiful if I just show you look at this I, I just want to get a lot more organised because uh, I'm responsible for a, a little human being and things are going really well but I just want them to get better and better and I just think it takes a lot of dedication and hard work but mostly when you're organised your, your head is lighter you know things make more sense to you I just think this is such a pretty book and I love the things that it says at the back Goals for 2019, highlights of 2018, and it's just, I just like it. So I've got loads to fill in this that will keep me busy. And my memory's not as good as it used to be, so sometimes writing things down, it's really good. And I, I actually like writing. My handwriting is quite pretty, you know. I did practice and join handwriting clubs when I was younger, and I think that in this day and age everyone's on their phones or iPads and everyone's forgotten the joy of handwriting and using pens and stationery and I think that's a shame and I think we've kind of become less physically creative so it's good to just you know keep your brain ticking write things down and you know well that's what I'm gonna do anyway and I think they were like three pounds a book so it's not that expensive we have another perfume oh, 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 oh.
this is a very interesting perfume right I got a sample of this perfume about four years ago I still have that sample to this day a tiny little sample like this and when I tried it I just fell in love with it I just loved it, it was different it was cool and couldn't find it anywhere couldn't find it anywhere I found it online for six pounds six pounds something like six pounds fifty I was like what why is it six pounds fifty anyway I just thought can't go wrong blind buy for six pounds fifty there is another retailer that's selling it for about fifty pounds we'll see this is very very interesting perfume that we can talk about Elvis and Jesus <laughs> Elvis and Jesus and look it's shaped like a Bible the, the, the actual packaging is shaped like a Bible I've never seen this in any shop I've not seen it online I've not seen it on YouTube and I just kind of want to do it justice so do I open it now well I've, I might as well but again, I think I'm going to give it its own platform and have a little conversation about it. It's kind of like very risque, isn't it? It's a bit blasphemous, isn't it? Elvis and Jesus. And do you know what? If you look closely, look, Elvis has got like the, the devil's tail and Jesus has got the saint ring. Hmm. Dearly beloveds, let us open the perfume box. Are you serious? <laughs> How cool. This one reminds me of Shawshank Redemption. Chapter one, what? Chapter one, embracing a rock and roll philosophy born out of the counterculture musings of the likes of Kinky Freidman, Hunter S. Thompson and even Karl Marx. Elvis Jesus e epitomizes the anti-capitalist dystopian rock and roll rumblings that have subverted that. This is a bit punk rock, you know, okay. Dr drug, sex, oh, okay, I've spit black, I, uh, Lord forget, I mean, I just don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Right, six pound perfume, that's worth 50 pounds. That's not available anywhere. The first thing that comes to mind is, is it discontinued? Has the company shut down? Has it gone into liquidation? Okay, pulling up. If this is a 100 mil, let's see. If it's anything like I remember, I think this is so cool. What a cool perfume bottle. But I need to read more about it. If it's, it sounds very naughty. I don't know where to spray, guys. I really don't. Um, oh, okay, that's a bit empty. I'll be really honest with you if it smells good. I love it. It smells exactly how I remember it. Six quid! Better get another one. I'll try to put the links down. It smells exactly how I remember it. It's extremely unisex. It's a unisex perfume. But your nose, it divides it in half. It's 50, um, 50 side feminine, 50 side, 50% 50 side, 50 feminine, 50% um, masculine. The masculine side comes out a bit more. But there's a perfume that reminds me of, this is good. It's kind of good. This is Pofem. It doesn't say Pofem, does it? Yeah, for her, it says for her. I like it. It's kind of, in my head I'm thinking rock chick, but I'm not, it's not really a rock chick scent, but it's just a unisex scent. It's kind of like a very, I don't know. We'll talk about this another time. Got to crack on, got to crack on. I like it. I'm just warming up now guys I'm so sorry Ugh. you know this video is going to be really 
all over the bloody place. Can I do? I am who I am. Mm. I love it. It's Friday today. So I'm probably going to order a big, fat Chinese takeaway. I normally cook fresh every day. But today, you know. Mm, we going to turn up. <laughs> Okay, what's next? I went to Mac. You, if you don't know about this, pay attention. Pay attention, please. Mac have a recycling scheme. It's called Back to Mac. It's very simple. If you have any Mac products, foundation, lipsticks, perfume, mascaras, lip gloss, whatever. If you have six of the empty package um, containers, not the packaging, the containers. If you take six back, you get a free lipstick. And that's what I do every year. I have a lot of MAC products. So I treated myself to some goodies. So I got a free Runway hit, which is a really beautiful matte. Am I wearing that now? No. I love this. It's a, I love matte lipsticks. I don't really buy anything else other than matte. This is Pink Pigeon. I love this one as well. It's like a nice magenta. Like the same colour as the flowers in my hair. And all fired up. It's like the most perfect red, especially for autumn, fall. And look at this. You know I love Betty Boop. Mac have got a Betty Boop. And it's um like a blue red matte. The only thing that's a bit disappointing. Oh god. The only thing that's disappointing is why didn't they put this design on the lipstick. The lipstick's just plain. And it's got the Betty Boop red matte T like trademark stamp. That's what it looks like. But come on, Mac. This design should be on the packaging, I think. I hope they change that all, consider that in the future. So I'm not getting rid of the packaging because I love my Betty Boop, I do. And this is about I've used it already. This is Lip Tensity Eros, and it's a I'm gonna say it's a cream matte, it's a cream matte lipstick. It doesn't say matte cream. But it's got a lot of emollient in it and it has got a sheen to it and to me matte is kind of like a powder dry non-shine uh, finish but this has got a cream kind of sheen to it it's lovely they have got every single color you can think of in the lip tensity range and i would say check it out and look the packaging's cool god there's so much dust because this has been sitting waiting for me to show to you so that's the max up my daughter is going to really enjoy tidying this up with mummy. <laughs> She's so over it. She's so over it. Oh my God. I just, do you know what? I, it's come to the point now. I'm not opening any more perfumes. I'm just going to show you what I've got. I'm going to have to do a separate video because it's going into the hour now. I'm looking on the camera. It's like an hour and two minutes. By the time I edit this down, it might be less time than that. But oh, I've just got to chop it up a bit, guys. I'm so sorry. Epic haul. Okay, so this is from Feel Unique. I really like this company. What does it say? Almost there. Oh, so when you're opening it. Okay. Lots of packaging. Lots of samples. Can't smell anything, but okay. 
quite generous to give me two in there. Gotta spray it on here now. Sexy. Very, very sexy. Pure Excess by Paco Rabanne. It's not as good as um, the million one. Okay, so in the fuel you need, we have... It's so hard. I say to you, I'm not going to open them. I'm looking at I'm thinking, but I've never... This is a blind buy. But I can't open it today. I just don't have the time. How lovely. So I've got Elizabeth Arden white tea. How do you say this? Lee Imperatrice by DMG. Never tried this either. And this is the 100 ml eau de toilette. What is this one? This is a 100 ml eau de toilette as well. And I've got some samples in here because it's you, Emporio Armani. I would not recommend doing this, guys. Do not pile up. Do not have a stockpile of stuff that is a month old. It's not wise because it's overwhelming and, you know, you've got to check your stuff out, really, when you get it. This is for women. <laughs> This smells like pear. Oh my god, this is this smells like a scent I've been waiting to. Oh, that is gorgeous. Because it's you by Emporio Armani. Oh wow, wow, wow. If you like pear fruity perfumes, this is a good one. Oh wow, I hope the bottle's beautiful. Oh, that's a sample. Oh wow, it's gorgeous. Oh, that's one of the pure excess samples. I must have fallen out. <clears throat> and this is white tea Elizabeth Arden hand cream that goes with the perfume bottle I don't know what to do <laughs> do I open it or do I do I can hear people screaming at me open it I've got to open it I've just got to. But there's so much more. There's so much more to show you. How many perfumes now? Quite a few. I've finished so many perfumes as well and I've given some away and you know, I've got some room now to enjoy some. Do you know, I smell... The, the bedroom smells absolutely incredible. Oh my God, it smells sensational. I'm so happy. Oh, please let me like this. So yeah, so that's how many blind buys? I was I was risky this season. I was risky with the blind buys. But you know what I do? I, I don't know if you guys do it. With blind buys, I definitely, definitely do my research. You know, I do my research and I check the notes and I think hmm if the notes are cool I'm probably gonna like it hmm oh god sorry guys some of these are hard to open so this is Elizabeth Arden white tea gorgeous let's have a look How beautiful is that? That's got to smell good. That's got to smell good. This is such an elegant looking design. But I just, let's see, nothing there. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. Yes, yes, Elizabeth. 
give me strength. It's a beautiful scent. This is perfect for late spring, summer, al fresco dining. It's just, it smells exquisite. It's um, fresh, light. It's exactly, it smell, it's like how you'd imagine white tea to smell like really. But it doesn't smell like tea like, it just smells so, like a beautiful, I'm gonna be honest, it smells like a beautiful, gentle, South Korean beauty. That's how I imagine it. A beautiful, have you seen like those fashion magazines with the South Korean women on there? They just look so gentle and beautiful. That's what it reminds me of. A beautiful, gentle woman. I'm just into South Korea at the moment. I, I don't know, I just, I'm into K-dramas. I don't know if anyone out there is into K-dramas. I'm just, I just discovered them on Netflix and I'm just in love. There's a drama that my daughter and I are totally obsessed with and it's called Heaven's Garden. I love it, I love it, I love it. And I've kind of gone all kind of Korean in my um, fashion interest and I just like the, I just like the um, landscapes of South Korea and the community and oh, just, I don't know, just into them. I'm just into South Koreans at the moment, just like into South Korea and God bless them with what they're going through. You know, and what they have, what they're having to face with North Korea at the moment. I don't want to get political on this perfume forum, but you know, the world is getting a bit crazy. Okay, so white tea. I have to open it. I just don't want to open it. I want to open it. I don't want to open it. I must be really bloody annoying to you guys at the moment. Sorry. Okay. Might as well just open it, right? Goodness sake. Well, I'm done with my perfumes for 2017. And I am going to do my wish list for next year. So, I have a few on my wish list. And I'm going to do a wish list video. Because I would love to share... Uh, the perfumes I've got my eye on and I would love to also hear what you have got your eye on you know I'm really into Anik Gutal perfumes at the moment I just think they're amazing I think her bottles are a little bit drab some of them are a little bit drab I'm not gonna lie but generally the scents the fragrance oh I've never tried this one Heard a lot about it. Oh, I like the bottle. Oh, okay. So this is number three, Le, Le Emperatrice. And I think that Dolce and Gabbana has um, based this around Naomi Campbell. like it. it's heavy it's very modern it's very kind of clinical modern nowhere to spray okay there's space on my the back of my hand well damn Daniel goodness sake I feel like I've been blessed by the perfume gods Every scent I have sprayed, I love. What is going on? Don't do this to me. I can't be this good. If I'm this good, I'll do it all the time. Oh my gosh, guys, this is... Oh, I don't know how to explain this. This is um, 
I can smell lychee pears and melons, watermelon. I can smell fruits, like very fresh, watery fruits. This has to be an eau de parfum because it just, it's not. It's an eau de toilette. It's got a huge punch. It seems very linear at the moment. Oh, wow. This is a winner. Grab it if you like your sweet, fresh fruities. Okay. Another random absolute white whitening pen. This is um, a whitening gel pen. Don't laugh at me. Whitening gel pen. And um, it's made in the USA. And it may white it may whiten teeth. Two shades whiter in one week with continued use i'm gonna give it a try i'm kind of into teeth whitening at the minute i think my teeth need whitening you know mm. <laughs> don't look too closely okay so i went to tk max and i found this battered packaging of some nails ink nail varnishes and it was $14.99 and I thought hmm let me speak to the manager so I said manager dear manager um the packaging could I get a discount from it because I actually do want to keep them in the packaging and he said no problem I was like okay um we'll reduce it to you we'll reduce it for you and I thought mm, normally it's a 10% no he charged me eight pounds for this eight pounds for one two three four good solid nails ink nail varnishes and this is going to be really really cool for christmas is coming up fireworks night is coming up i just think these are really fun you know really fun and that one is called they have got some cool names they're all named after english roads um, in I think roads in London, Belsize Road, Belsize or Belsies, Belsize Road. This is Royal Avenue. So much fun, and this is St James. It's like in Westminster. And this is a nails ink gel effect. And it's Grobner Crescent. So I'm going to have fun with those. You know what the moral of the story is? If you don't ask, you don't get. It's either a yes or no, isn't it? Okie dokie. Next we have, oh, another Yankee candle. Oh, I love this. My daughter loves this scent as well. This is a, tr what, what you see is what you get. See that picture? Lemon. This is not Yankee candle. Apologies, guys. This is a village candle perfume. And what you see is what you get. This is a lemon pound cake. It smells exactly like the picture. It is the most arousing scent because it just opens up my, my being and it makes me have a good well-being. It smells of lemon cake, lemon drizzle cake, lemon pound cake with all the icing and everything. I just don't know how they've managed to do this so perfectly, but it's perfectly yummy and beautiful. I'd recommend you light this up in the kitchen, like make sure that your kitchen is totally, totally clean, bleached, clean, fresh. Make sure that your kitchen is thoroughly clean, that you haven't got any scent, you know, lingering in your kitchen and burn this in your kitchen or your entrance hallway or your living room or even your bedroom it is going to fill the room. It is one of the, my favorite, favorite scents. So this is like Village Candle. And this is Yankee Candle. See how similar they are? You get more product with a Village Candle and you get two wicks. 
with a village candle you get one wick with a yankee candle but i'm telling you this is cheaper for some crazy reason and it's just yummy in every way and every autumn christmas i'm always burning this in my house it's just something so wonderful about your house smelling beautiful you know right let's crack on another candle here this is white pumpkin oh my god this little candle has just got the most amazing scent it's just so mouth-watering beautiful 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 scent it is so delicious it is perfect again wonderful for the season autumn end of summer's coming up autumn christmas time winter time it's just mouth-watering good lovely aroma it's just gonna and it, this tiny little candle it smells so strong i really do you know what i want to see if i, I want to burn it now because i really want to know if this tiny little candle is giving me such an amazing cold scent is it going to burn the same way I'm going to give you an update and see how quick the smell starts to spread because it just smells amazing. It really, really does. I'm so impressed with the cold scent. Please don't let me down. I don't know where to put it. I'm, everything is just so filled up with all these goodies. Right. Okay, some more chokers. Like I said, I'm going to do a choker collection video. Why not? You know, another reason why I've got this garland on, not just to make me happy and to bring a little bit of sunshine in your life, but also I've got bad hair day, you know, I'm taking my hair out soon and it's just to kind of cover up the mess. <laughs> the things we do, the things we ladies do, and that's a secret, okay? Don't tell, any, don't tell anyone. Oh, this is cute. Now, I don't know. I mean, this is pretty, right? And again, I got it with my vouchers. But, like, the original price is, like, it's just a ridiculous amount. On, it, I think it was, like, £20, and on sale, it's, like, £3. Wait for the sales with ASOS, guys. Don't... Just be patient. Sales are good. How can it jump from £20 to £3? It goes to show you. But I wouldn't pay £20 for that choker. It's pretty, but £20, what is it, made of gold? So another choker i'm just hoping that somebody's going to get married or there's going to be a christening soon it seems like people have stopped getting married around here and i can wear these look at this this is another very expensive choker that i got on sale <laughs> so pretty i don't know if it had a name no, there's no name to it. I think it had like a Japanese kind of um, description. It's just so pretty. Really, really into my chokers. Love them. Okay. The candle is going to take a little while to well properly. So uh, I don't know if I'm going to smell it. Also, there's just an abundance of beautiful scents from all the perfumes that are sprayed. So who knows okay so those are the chokers oh this is so pretty it's following that theme that iridescent theme i picked these up and i picked these up in a store called matalan and this is called enchanted collection and you've got three decorative tea light holders and it's got a mirror so it's got a mirror that it sits on if you look at the back so i'm just i've just done so these will stay in my bedroom. I've got a lovely empty shelf that they can go on. And they're just so pretty, they're so pretty. What is this? What is this? It's another perfume. <laughs> okay, I think we've got another perfume here. Another perfume, guys. <gasps> I 
I remember what this is. I remember. You know what? It's so good to use voucher codes and it's so good to use your points because you can get so much freebies, guys. Freebies beyond freebies, honestly. I'm so excited to show you this one. Oh, I'm so excited. This is... I'm not going to open it. I'm just not going to open it. This is Miss Dior. This is Miss Dior Silky Body Mist. And they've sent me a Jean-Paul Gaultier Scandal. This is so gorgeous. This is like one of the best fruity floral gourmands. I know a lot of people are sick of them, but I just love them. I really do like fruity floral gourmands. This is such a beautiful perfume. If you can get a sample to try, I recommend it. I love this perfume. I don't even need to try it. It's gorgeous. Anytime I go into a perfume shop, I try that on. It's amazing. Now, this is Miss Dior Silky Body Mist. And this is a 100ml. You can spray it in your hair. I've heard so many good reviews about this one. It's uh, it's meant to smell not like Miss Dior. It's meant to smell like Miss Dior Blooming Bouquet. And I really love <laughs> Miss Dior Blooming Bouquet. I love that scent. So if it smells like that, I will promise you, I will tell you right now. Thank you for staying with me. I'm sorry, guys, that it's taken so long. I just, it's just, it is what it is, you know. Okay, ready? So this is ooh, this glass. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, it's got that dog tooth effect. effect. It's very typical Christian Dior design. Oh, it's lovely. It's nice. It's got a nice weight to it as well. It's so pretty. Oh, it's got an invisible dip tube. What? What? <laughs> I haven't talked about invisible dip tubes for a long time. Wow. Okay. What do, I, what do I spray? What do I do? I'll spray it right here. Oh, God, it's gorgeous. Wow. It's quite strong. Oh, it's lovely. It's lovely. It's lovely. It's lovely. This is not... Oh, this is just so... Exquisite. Try to get your hands on that one. I'm not going to spray it in my hair because my hair needs washing and um, I'm not going to waste it on my hair right now. But, oh, it's amazing. Right. The, ir the iridescent theme. This is from Primark. It's a kind of like iridescent pearl brush. That's cute. It's only, I can't remember, maybe it's like a couple of pounds. Another Primark. This is a, Be a Unicorn. <laughs> we had the Mermaids and now we've got the Beat the Unicorn. So this is Be a Unicorn perfume. And this is really nice. I bought one for my daughter just to put in her school bag. And then when she finishes PE, gym class, she can freshen up after her school day or in the morning. You know, she's a teenager now. So she's kind of like getting to that stage where she's just putting on her lip balm and you know, brushing her hair and keeping up her appearances. And I bought one for myself. It's two pounds, I think. And it's just nice. It's a nice handbag perfume. I think it's quite cute. It's got a nice floral backing as well. Okay. Oh, I'm on Snapchat, by the way. I think my name's Missouri Love on Snapchat too. And I've got a lot of young friends on Snapchat. I love to be friends with young, younger people, people in their 20s. I'm 38. The reason why I like to be friends with younger people because they keep you up to date with stuff, you know? 
and they have a budget themselves you know because they're at uni or studying so they don't really have a lot of money to spend so they can tell you where to get things cheaper and uh, I haven't this, this came today in the post I've just taken off my address label but um, my friend Ikram she's so beautiful but she had some false eyelashes on and they just looked amazing and she was telling everyone that they were like 2 99 and she put the link she sent me the link so oh god they look good so these are and it's free delivery 2 99 on eBay free delivery if I can organize myself I'll put all the links at some point okay in the description box so this is Flutterland natural mink lashes they look so good they look big though I don't know if I'll wear them maybe I'll wear them for a video but these are mink lashes please excuse my manicure they look really good wow okay and they were like 2 99 and they came I think within a day two days or a day oh my birthday cards <laughs> I'll show you the birthday present my daughter got me I love you mommy happy birthday <laughs> oh so this is very me don't tell me to relax very very me sometimes when I've got to do something, don't tell me to relax, basically. <clears throat> when it's time to relax, I will relax. I will, because I'm a Leo, I'm a lion. I love to relax. But when I've got things to do, don't tell me to relax. If I'm uptight and stressed out, leave me alone. Don't tell me to calm down. Oh, yeah. This is um, another ASOS choker. Liars and Lovers. That's the brand. And it's a choker and a Laray. Lariat. Not a Laray. So this is a choker and a lariat. And very inexpensive. And very beautiful. Wow, look at that. I'll wear that for a video to show to you one day. Put that back in. And my sister bought me a beautiful bouquet of flowers for my birthday it was so amazing i've never had that before never had flowers sent to me on my birthday and i thought that was so amazing i'll never forget that it was so wonderful and the dpd delivery driver he sang to me it's on my instagram somewhere birthday to you oh yes happy birthday to you oh yes happy birthday oh. dear Shanta. happy birthday sis lots of love from carol selena and dane enjoy your day and so she got it from next and she also sent me a perfume this is just pink edt perfume from next and it's a 30 mil i'm gonna open it another time because i just i really don't have any space and I don't have much time left. These are from Henny's. Some beautiful iridescent earrings. That whole iridescent theme. It's the unicorn theme. My daughter will not like me saying this because she's a mermaid girl. But you know, Zai, I'm a mermaid mummy too. But you know, we've got to unite with the unicorns. Okay? I have a Boots card. And every so often you can use your points. And they had a Ted Baker sale. So I got myself a little Ted Baker makeup bag. I thought this is really lovely. Yeah. Got some lip balms because in the winter time, you know, your lips need more care. So that's uh, vanilla flavour, tropical flavour and strawberry flavour. And it's got UVA, UVB sunscreen protection and it's suitable for children. So I'm going to share that with my daughter. Oh, yeah. Guys, if you live in the United Kingdom and you shop at Super Drugs, go and shop online. You get next day free delivery to store. You get delivery at your home address for free. That's not next day though. And you get um, free click and collect, but next day delivery specifically to store is free at the moment anyway. 
and I got a three for two deal on my favourite mascaras of the moment, which are by Bourjois. So I've got three mascaras for £11.98, which is really good considering they're about £8 each or more. So I've got, um, it's the Volume Reveal Bourjois Mascara, it's waterproof. This one is waterproof black. This one is black. I love how it says wrapped for your protection and hygiene. I like that. And it comes with this really cool zoom mirror. And it, it's very good. You can apply your lipstick or your mascara, obviously the mascara to it. This one is really cool. This is radiant black. Is it that one? No, it's this one, sorry. It's this normal black one. It says adjustable volume. And what it says is reapply anytime without clumps. And that is the perfect mascara. I really want to try that. Because I love to I love to put layers of mascara on without it clumping. So fingers crossed that works. So I've got mascaras from that. From that. Right, what's in here? Oh, another poker. <laughs> Considering they're all free with the vouchers this is um, ASOS Curve Chainmail Choker they have a curve range which is designed for the fuller figured lady I'm sure it will fit me anyway but you know it's, I just wanted to check it out I think like these, these things are like a pound one pound because they're on sale Ooh, that's so pretty. Oh, yes. Da, 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 da. It's very disco, isn't it? It's very blondy. Oh, can I love and kiss a guy? Soon turned out he was a pain in the ass. I've got so much to sort out. Okay, this is a bit saucy. Remember that top, the, the floral top I got from Pretty Little Thing? Well, ladies, get into Vogue because, you know, what's in trend now are the brassiers, the bras that have the cross strap. I think they're very sexy, very, very sexy. And I bought myself a few. I'll show you one. Well, the chicken fillets are coming out. So look at this. How? I mean, look at this contraption, guys. Whoa. So, you know, you put this on underneath and then you put your sheer top. Oh, yes. I won't show you the matching knickers. I think that's more than enough to show you. I have my limits. Okay, we're getting to the end now ish this is too much I can't, it's too much it's an hour and a half guys are you still with me i've got so much more to show you i'm trying my best to be quick and i can't it's just so much this is an epic haul it's an epic haul i warned you would you like to see this is an epic haul, guys. I warned you. I did warn you, didn't I? My birthday perfume, 2017. This is one sexy beast of a perfume. This is Lancome La Nuit Trésor. Ah, 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 ah. Ah, 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 ah. Le de parfum. Le de parfum. Eh. Ah. Ooh. Ah, yeah. Baby, give it to me one time. Mm. Oh. Okay. 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 Oof, the bo 
box is sculpted to fit this beast of a perfume. A beast! I'm telling you, you spray this your perfume upon your skin. Let me tell you something. You're going to cause trouble. Oh, it's just beautiful. And that's all I've got to say. I'm just going to have to wait for another day. So, another one, another one, another one, another one. Oh, this. I saw this art piece. And I said, you know what? I've just got, I just want to wake up on my birthday morning with a top knot and a kimono. And I got this from TK Maxx. How, look at the design. I didn't go in there for this, but what I went in for wasn't in stock. And I just saw this and I said, I've got to have it. I've got to have it. To the end of the road so we come to the end of the road I have the receipt I'm gonna frame the receipt because I got this perfume for 11 pounds I got a corporate discount because they messed up my order this was originally 22 pounds 22 pounds in the fragrance shop and I got it for £11. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. And the reason why they messed up my order is because when I ordered it online, it came with a free DKNY tote bag. When I went to collect it in store, they said that they don't have any left. I said, well, you didn't inform me. You didn't inform me. La-di-da, la-di-da, la-di-da. So I had to come back another day they got me the tote bag and they gave me 50% off. Can you imagine? 11 pounds. This is the bag that got me the discount. <laughs> it's so ice white. And it's um, PVC, so it's gonna be really easy to clean. Nice shopping bag. These look great. Oh! This is DKNY Limited Edition Sparkling Apple. I love the original apple, but I love sparkles. And we're coming up to the season of Diwali. We're coming up to fireworks night, we're coming up to Christmas. So why not? You know, it's a mood lifter. It's a sweet, crispy kind of apple scent. Oh, it just smells 
really sweet, fresh, green, crunchy apple. Exactly what it smells like. A sweet, crispy, green apple with sparkles. They don't come onto the skin, but they're on the lid and it's a bit of fun. And it's 11 pounds, so happy. Okay. I think that's all the perfumes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, yeah. Twelve. Where's the twelfth one? Oh yeah, twelve. So those are all the perfumes. Right. And I'm just gonna show you the other bits that I've got that important dove soap i highly recommend to wash your face your skin everything i just love this this is really lovely soap it's quite an, a, a normal everyday soap but that's what i use and it's good for sensitive skin and oh and i bought this i'm going to put it on i think after this video This is the last of the goodies. I bought one for me and one for my brother. My brother's birthday is next month. And he taught me a lot in regards to music and building my taste in certain genres of music. This looks so cool. So I've got one for me and one for my brother. He doesn't know. So the album is called Interpretations and it's celebrating the music of Earth, Wind and Fire. So if you like a bit of Earth, Wind and Fire, but it's got like some of my favorite kind of like neo soul uh, singers and it's their interpretation. So it's like a neo soul style of Earth, Wind and Fire songs. Got like Angie Stone, Shaka Khan, Duele, Kirk Franklin, Lala Hathaway, Ledacy, Michelle, I can't really pronounce her name, I can't remember how to pronounce it, Nigia Cello, Cello, sorry. Please welcome Michelle and Deggio Cello. Mint Condition, Music Soul Child, The Randy Watson Experience, and featuring Bilal. And it's got 10 tracks on here, so that will be fun. So one for me, one for my brother. I haven't done a video in a long time. Obviously this is gonna be edited down and I'm looking on the iPad and it says one hour and 48 minutes. This is only for people that really genuinely like my videos and I feel like you deserve this. I hope that you've had breaks. I hope you pause me. I hope you skip to the bits that you like. <laughs> I mean, I know it's long. I know I'm a chatterbox. I just, didn't have time to organize this the way that I wanted to and I just thought it's just more natural just to show you everything that I have in just one go and it would have been maybe nicer to do all the perfumes first and then show you um, the other bits that I've got but I, sorry guys I'm just I wasn't organized today and I hope you've had fun I sure have and uh, I'm gonna have a lot of fun tidying up all this stuff. I mean, there's so much things. I feel very spoiled, very loved. Thank you everyone for the presents that you've sent me. And, um, you know, I just hope that when I do the future videos that I can break down the perfumes that I've opened and shared with you and give you a little bit more detail on them. But yeah, that was an epic haul. It's probably the last time I'll do an epic haul because it's exhausting and uh overwhelming <laughs> but much love to you all i will be uploading some videos in the next week i just need to take up my hair freshen up myself da -da 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 -dee, da -da 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 -da. and i'll be back i'll be back all right much love to you and check me out on instagram please like and subscribe if you want to see more videos from me and peace out guys lots of love bye smooches as always big big time smooches Mwah.